What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Red Up to the Mario Plus Rabbits Kingdom Battle once again with my bro Zoo. Hey, yo. Yeah, for some reason, he's leaving the room. They don't want to hear me open that container. Should have opened it before he came out. Anyway, last episode, you guys, we made our way through more of World 1, and eventually, we made it to this. This is going to be our first mid boss and first real boss. Well, first boss of this game so let's uh let's get into it jump right into it hey luigi bro how's it going man i think he likes to oversell his whole coward scaredy cat thing yeah Rabbit plant, noxious fireweed. Not the worst name ever. No. Wait. Did it? There it is. Okay. Yep, and mid boss. Okay, so let's see what we're getting with. 300 health, fire burn rocket, that's gonna hurt. And he can basically move everywhere. Okay, got Ziggy over here. Nothing over here. No, okay. Okay, so just two Ziggies and the boss. Not, not too bad. Alright, none of you guys can hit him, right? No, okay, so Mario or Rabbit. Um, Bobby Luigi, you're gonna be focused on dealing with this guy. Make sure, you know, make sure there's less damage coming in. Clear off the mobs. Yeah. Okay, didn't kill, but that's fine. I'm gonna put your shield up because you're gonna be taking damage in that turn. And we'll have a peach. I say you come over and do the exact same thing. You guys have a bit more movement range. You'd be able to dash and then do it, but... You just... Okay. Your shield up. And Mario, what can you do here? Mario can't get to any of the pipes. I'll uh, have him just come over here start taking pot shots at the full cover. Weaken. Oh, first shot and his... Yeah. Oh, and he killed his own goon. Before his goon could move. Excellent. He was aiming for Rabbit Peach. Got his own goon instead. Alright, Mario, can you walk? You can't dash them, okay. Yeah. Right, no, come back to Mario. Okay. Yeah, still can't do anything, Mario. But uh, come over here at least. No. Okay, we'll have it Luigi. Good, you can dash him. Come back down to yeah, but I don't think you can hit him from up there. And else he can't move over there. So I might as well come down here. And come over here. Okay, are you close enough to hit the boss? No, you're not. Peach can stay up here, though. Excellent. Okay. I 
kind of knew that was going to happen, but I also forgot about it. Oh, they're going to say special thing, they already say get it critical. No, save it for the main characters. Okay, Luigi. You can come over here, jump up here, and get the critical high ground bonus. And burn him. No burn. And it's just out of the way and get by the peak. Okay. Is it close enough? Nope. <laughs> almost, uh, almost about the time I Oh, yeah, I can't really do a whole lot here, can you? You're putting him behind the wall next to it. Otherwise, he's gonna get kicked by both of us. You're gonna have to put him here. Maybe he'll get hit by his own attack. I doubt it, but. Okay. No. At least not close enough to get a dash on him. More damage. Critical, but bad enough. And Mario can't do anything. Can you hit him, Luigi? No, you can't. Okay. Got him. Dude, that's going behind the fight break again. I get the crit. Chemicals near a girl. We all know how this is going to go. What? And get decapitated. I mean, forcibly separated. So you want to me it could be for like a snide voice? Yep. <clears throat> ah, so you're the other half of the favorite duo, Mario and... And... Yeah. Luis? Lyle? Llewellyn? <laughs> oh, well, all the same, welcome. You would get a little piss on it. You didn't mean to call me that. Well, no, you're the people. You're oh. not good enough as Luigi's shoe. That was annoying that people can't, like, they call Luigi, like, Green Stash, Green Mario. It's like, come on. How hard is it to remember Luigi? And, yep, can hit up to three enemies in a row from afar. Not really. And we get a skill tree. Right? That's, we unlocked it? Yeah, we did. Excellent. Alright, so we got 10 power orbs to spend. We can either get Mario to stomp jump, where he hurts an enemy by landing on him, a hammer, or nothing else. What do you think? Hammer or jump? Not that jump, because you can do that every turn if you could do it right. True. And the hammer is more useful for like 
finishing enemies. Okay. Rabbit well, Peach. Can't get nothing. Right. Rabbit well, Luigi. Can I get Weaken? Rocket. Oh, Vamp Dash. That's gonna be the first thing he's gonna get. So yeah. we'll hold off on that. And Luigi can only get each feet, sentry, or double jump. Let's give him his sentry. Yep. And we'll start chasing target. It'll detonate when it gets close. It can be destroyed. Neat. And I buy him a new weapon, except I'm... The game likes pulling this whole, you unlock a character. Congratulations. We'll give you a weapon later on. So I'm gonna hold off on that for the time being. And we get through the lawns. Okay. It's supposed to be a pun on something. Yeah, the ju whole jungle thing. Neat. Ah, you've got to admire their dedication to hiding. They look very uncomfortable. I think you're gonna do that this time. I know, but I'm trying. Yes, I, I know, but I'm trying to get into it. Yeah. All right. Can't do anything here or over there. Button, button, where are the buttons? <laughs> you know, you could help us save the Mushroom Kingdom instead of just lounging around. Hello? Actually, let's try coffee. Ah, here we go. Yeah. New weapon. So, I have I apologize, I'm not like super like, oh my god, this is such a great game, you guys, because it is. It's a fun game to play. But I apologize, I just got off playing Pokemon Sword and, um. It's kind of a little bullshit. Near the end, so. If you guys want to go check out the latest episode of that, uh, go ahead and hit. Yep, Spike Strike. Things are gonna, uh, there are gonna be some really angry spikes when all this is over. Okay. Yeah! So let's see what kind of weapon it is. If it's not an ink weapon, I'm not getting it. Because Luigi ink. Alright. Luigi. Spike strike, no, it's bounce. Okay, so I could've gotten him a bit, uh, ink weapon. Low in the action, get things moving again with the Space Age Sharpshooter. Nice. Alright, so we, so we get the new gun. And next battle we get, I am gonna have him on the team. Alright, so is that another switch around here? Yeah, there is, okay. Neat, okay. So now that load all the blue things. Can you imagine people thought that's all you got for that with those coins and then they stop? Like they just continued on, they didn't pay attention. That would be annoying. Okay, gotta find a red switch now. Right. Yeah, gotta find the red switch. Oh wait. There we, there we are. Excellent. There's nothing over there, so it's... There's something over here, wasn't there? Yep. Red coins. Alright, this will give us another weapon. And if this is also a Luigi weapon, I will be upset. Upset is spaghetti. Never a phrase I've ever heard. Never say it again. Ever. That sounds like something Ned Flanders would have said. I think he does. Alright, where's the eight point? There it is. Oh. Excellent. Alright. Let's 
go see what this is. There we get. Bum 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 bum. Why we get the new hammer? Or is it the him? Yeah. Okay. I don't know how to learn that. Oh, I do that. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll one on the on the bubble. Right. I, I, one interesting thing that's um happened recently is um I'll okay. talk about this battle. Okay. There's a lot of things here. All right. So let's see what we're dealing with here. All right. Two Ziggies immediately up front. Two more in the back, plus a hopper. Okay, so six enemies, right? Yeah, that's two, three, four. Okay, sorry, sorry. Three Ziggies in the back. Okay. So. Who should we leave out for Luigi? I think Peach is gonna have a Yeah. Alright, we're taking the Luigi's. Alright. So let's fight. Okay. Mm. Okay. Let's have. Actually, you know what? Um. I fucking mind if bounce each. Like I thought. Okay, so let's have the Mario Luigi there. Yeah, okay, I can. Alright, Flabby Luigi, you come over here. Right, hit that guy. Boom. Mario. Can bounce on off him. Kill him. And then yeah. start attacking the other guy. Yeah, like I said, I do have an interesting-ish story to uh, tell that I kind of wish I had mentioned earlier, but... Uh, is, um... Uh, what do I want to say here? Yeah. yeah. Anyway, uh, last week, you guys, like, on New Year's, I basically went in to work. Basically, it, it wasn't a particularly long shift. It was just a, a new, you know, a shift on, I'm a winner. you know, uh, New Year's. Don't know why that took me so long to think of. So I ended up walking to work, which is about four miles, give or take. Which, in January, you'd think would be pretty bad. And it was. Yeah, yeah thank you. Well, I mean, not as bad as it could have been. I just wasted Luigi Steel's syrup because apparently you no know, one close enough to get it. Did I? No, never mind. I used that simple one. Okay. Anyway, so, yeah. I ended up having to walk to work, which, again, you would think in the middle of January, well, the start of January, would be pretty bad. No, it was pretty mild. It was actually, yeah. It was actually quite pleasant. And... Hell, I felt too warm at times, because I, I was wearing like two jackets, so I was like, you know, a little too warm. Anyway, I walked to work, nothing interesting happens, you know, just a typical walk to work. When, like, when I get to work, I see uh, a bike near our cash registers. Like, at the front, near the front store. And I just walk right past it. Because I, I gotta go put my stuff in the locker. Well, lockers. So I'm just like, okay. I'll put my stuff in the bag. Go. And then I come out to go, you know, use the restroom. Where I see someone has moved the bike. Clearly trying to get my attention. Now that I realize it in hindsight. Like, hey, we want you to look at this bike, which, you know, whatever. 
So I grab the bathroom key because we require one. Go, go, go do my business. And as I get back, I see my manager, Wendy. Also, you missed another critical. Oh, pay attention. Also, I didn't want to aim into a gear thing. Yeah. Anyway. Just a bit. Anyway, I see my manager Wendy standing by the, um, the bike with her the phone out. I'm just like, okay. Like, like she, she was giggling and really trying to get my attention. So I'm like, okay, why is Wendy so happy? Oh, no. And I noticed that this bike has, like, castles on it. And, you know, like, the kind of stuff you would see you on... around the ring around the tree. Yes. And, uh, with an envelope with my name on it. Yeah. That's the form. So, I'm like, wait, why doesn't this bike have my name on it? And I open up the bike, well, <laughs> open up the bike, open up the envelope, and find out that this bike, this Whoa. brand new bike, was my Christmas present. All my co-workers, plus a few other people, including one of my neighbors, apparently, chipped in to buy me a new bicycle, because mine got wrecked a few weeks ago. Well, a couple months ago, actually. And when they finally revealed that to me, I'm just like... Stunned. You know, I'm like, oh my god, holy... Like, I'm so stunned, I actually swear, which... I don't like doing at work. You know, I don't want to get in trouble. But I'm just like, holy crap. I, I get a new bike? And they're like, yep, this is your Christmas present. And apparently, according to my boss, they've been hinting at this for months. Like a couple times they say, like, okay, see, did you get a new bike for Christmas? No. Like, oh, that's weird. Which I never put any stock into. I was just like, okay, they're asking about my bike. That's it. Com took me by complete fucking surprise. I'll say that much. <laughs> so yeah, that really, you know, just came out of left field for me. I was so stunned, you guys have no idea. And oh my god, it's just, you know, it's one of those things where you're just like, you know, I have a great job. Both because the job I like is nice, but also because my co-workers were just like, you know what, Casey's done a lot for us. Like, you know, coming to cover our shift when we couldn't. We should repay that, and just, you know, I'm just so touched, basically. Anyway, there's a chain chop and chain champ chomp in this next battle, which we'll do next episode, because this, actually, actually, you know what, no, fuck it, we're at 23 minutes, we'll do this battle. I'm in too good a mood telling this story. So, yeah, and to top it off, in addition to the brand new bike, my manager's husband, it was like, Casey, you got a few minutes before you gotta clock into work, right? Yep. We're going up to Walmart. Why? To get you a bike lock. But I already have bike locks. Like, nope, we're getting you a brand new one. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> anyway. If my readings are accurate, that's a chain chomp. It may be asleep now, but as soon as it senses our presence, it'll wake up eager to bite us. Or well, one of those enemies, really. A chain job doesn't discriminate. Good for it. It's 2021. No discrimination. It'll just zero in on the closest target. So it is discriminating against where it's closest. I mean, it could also just, you know, be like the side of man. The good news is that the chain job will only charge once we've completed our turn. Good to know. Alright, so let's uh, see what we're doing with here. Okay, change up done 75 damage, 4 cells of movement. Great. So we got 4 hoppers and a ziggy all the way at the back. Great. Okay, so how far can I go before you? 
Okay, so here. Alright. So what I'm thinking we do is dash one of these guys and then come over here. Yeah. Cause that way he'll go after that shark. Uh that Ziggy. Kill him. Okay. And Luigi can't do much of anything. But that's that's fine. It's fine. You know, sniper is fine. Wow, he hit that Ziggy all the way in the back. Do it. Nope. No quit. That's okay. That's 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 okay. Come over here. Okay, let's just make sure one check. Yeah, I have 78 feet that Garden Ziggy is going to die. I'm not sure. Okay. Down he goes. Alright. And we'll put a few up there, yeah. And we'll use both of those sides again. Yeah. Alright. And... Lemo. And down it goes. Alright. Oh. Kinda of hoping you'd aim for Luigi there. Eh? No. Oh, there's a critical ink shot. Nailed it. That's one thing I always hate about the Steely Stare and Hill Sight is they all zero in on like the same target, which really I hate that they do that. I really do. Okay, that chain that thing is going to die. So we'll have we can come up over here. Okay, let's see. Yeah. 100% chance of hitting that hop in the back. I call that one hopper right there, Ziggy. No, you can't do that. Okay. Okay, we're gonna have Mario come over here. Oh, he can bounce on this guy. Excellent. And then come back over here. I bet Luigi's not gonna be much. Well, I mean, I kind of wish it hit Barry, but that's okay. Hey, hey, hey! What's up, hot foot, hot foot, hot foot? Okay. No, no, no. They lift the O, so. All that makes me think of is the Door of the Explorer movie. Like the live action one, and uh, it is so cringe worthy. Alright. Uh, Turn him again! <laughs> Which I I would be like, oh my god, it hit again, but then I went over with Rabbit Luigi, he has a 60% turn chance on Poppers. So. And down it goes. Alright. I actually it turned out pretty okay. Yeah. Alrighty. So we get more money, more orbs, and now it's time to upgrade some stuff. Rabbit Peach. Should I get you your double jump or double dash? Your sentry or heal? Heal. Yep. Oh, okay, Rabbit Luigi, you get the vamp down. Yes. Luigi can't do anything. Mario, you're getting a hammer. Okay, well, let's check out, because I know he got another hammer. Okay. 
Okay, the bell's about a honey weapon, which I don't like for that. And a bounce. Should I give him a hammer? No, it's a bounce. Why, why not? You. Yep. No, no, it doesn't hurt me. The hammer won't hurt me. No, but they bounce off. No. Yeah, I want them to bounce off because the hammer is going to be close quarters. I want to kind of finish them off, and if I can't finish them off, I'll bounce them away. Alright. Alright, let's see what else. Okay, Luigi has no... No things. Okay. You know what? Let's give him a bounce hammer. Why not? Okay. There we are. Uh oh, broken bridge ahead. I guess we need to find an alternative to continue on our path. Oh, really? I thought we'd jump, because well, that's not too far to jump, it's just jumping. Yeah, and then jumping on snapping out of the air. Right. Okay, well, turn this around. Get all these coins. That was an 8 inch bubble wand in all world. That was an 80 feet. We'll have to bring over a burrito next time. No! Do you know what's pain the ass that's gonna be? Especially, especially when it comes back out. No, no, I mean, that's like... Yeah, I, I know. And we get the flopper plant. Nice. I don't want to that as a... No, we, we get it as a 3D model. Do you want that thing as a companion, really? I don't know. Yes. Oh, yeah, that is fun Ugh, I don't want to tell them what that sponge was used for back home. It ruined their fun. For what? The toilet? Dishes? Did you use anything there? You don't really have to be busy with Twitter. Well, I'm just, my, I think the joke I is that... That on a loofah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, finding those rabid, like, flavor text things, that's always a, a fun part of playing this game. Less fun in people's... meh about it. Well, people's opinion is charged for the most part. There's a tiny plaque here from the artist that reads, Rabbit building a log cabin. I wonder what that means. He's taking a poop. That's a joke. You're welcome, internet. And we get another 3D model of Luigi. Excellent. Anyway, guys, uh, that's going to be it for this episode. Because it's going a bit long, and yeah. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to leave a like on this video. Uh, comment down below on really anything. What was, you, like, what sort of, you know, something you were surprised with that worked. You know, how I, you know, that sort of thing. And, uh, don't forget, uh, don't forget to go check out my other series on my channel. There's quite a few up there. You might find something you like more than this. I doubt it, but maybe. And as always, guys, I'd appreciate it if you go check out Zero's Twitch channel. The link will be in the top of the description. I apologize, he hasn't really been involved in this episode. He's yeah, so my stomach's just feeling like in a knot right now. And he's also on his phone. It's not being very professional, is he? In my defense, you are talking more, so I don't know what you Yeah, okay. When you happy story. Yeah. But anyway, guys, like I said, um, yeah, that's going to be it for this episode. Next episode, we'll continue on to Chapter 7. And, um... Yeah, I really hope you guys are having a good day, night, whenever you're watching this. And also, I would really appreciate you guys if you would subscribe, join my alliance, and let's see if we can get to 60 before uh, May 20th. Let's do it, people. Yep, come on. And don't forget to ring the bell. I don't know which bell, but apparently you gotta ring it. <laughs> anyway, guys, um, 
Yeah. I will see you next time uh, for the next episode. Till then, have a good day or night whenever you're watching it. Bye. Take care.